Good morning, good afternoon, and a very good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Code Veronica here with Morris at the end of the last part. Alfred slash Alexia slash whoever else he slash she wants to be. is Jason is down with a fighter jet. Steve is busy regaining control of the plane. I gotta tell you, this is not at all something I was expecting to be doing in this game. <laughs> this is sort of, this is almost like the transition between old school and new school. Chased down by, like, Harrier jets? What is this? Use the Stinger missiles. What's with the heartbeats this time? We know what's chasing us. I picked up another first aid spray and did save it, by the way. Just in case... Well, this exact situation. This is exactly the reason I did it. Wow, there's really nowhere to go at all. Oh my. Oh my lord. Lord have mercy. What am I supposed to do here? Materials preparation complete. Catapult ready. Oh. Not quite. So now what? So do I have to just like keep him busy? Or do I have to stun him and then do it? That seems like a really likely thing. Oh wow, he's he is quick. He is quick. He is quick like a cat. Maybe I should uh Wow, I can't I really can't take too many of those. <laughs> Why are these acid rounds so shit? Ah! Whoa! You can get knocked out at the end of the plane! Oh, okay. Okay, no, you can you can get knocked out at the end of the plane. I, I well, pfft. I did not realize that. Okay then. Well, maybe we should reevaluate what the hell we're doing with our lives. Uh, you know what? Let's uh, let's keep these out because they 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 were working. They just you know he blindsided us. That was, that was the only problem. Wow, first aid sprays are really going to be worth nothing if I can just get knocked out at the end of this plane. <laughs> Uh, alrighty. Um, you know what? We'll we'll stick with grenade rounds for now, just because there's more of them. Actually, no, no. Let's stick with the acid rounds. Let's not, let's not second guess ourselves now. And you know what? We won't use the catapult straight away. We'll just we'll knock we'll get him on his ass and then we'll use it, so we don't have to wait for it to recharge. Because now we know the gimmick of the fight. Can I get through this door quicker, please? Actually, can you skip cutscenes in this? We'll soon find out. And yes, you can. Catapult is ready. Oh, I gotta get him before he starts that damn animation. Oh my god, he waits. He waits for you to get up. It's crazy. Alright, let's not stand uh, too close to the edge. Ah, flame rounds. Ah. Your worst nightmare. Ah, jeez. Okay. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's use one of these. See if I can get him on his. Uh, if I can just get him on his knees first. Maybe, just maybe. I can't believe he hit me. It's crazy. This boss is something else. Okay, maybe we just go all out with the anti-BOW round. Aha! Oh, Jesus. Really? Really? Again? No! Come on, how does that not do it? Who made these rounds? Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, he's got me in a corner. This is not good. Uh, flame rounds, I guess. And we're about to get killed. Oh god, I thought I could maybe just mash it out. This is He's got me in a corner, it's all over. It's all over, I can't get past. Oh no, we did it, we made it. Okay, I can like survive one more hit. And then it's over. Ah, and I missed. He's also walking a little bit slower, so maybe we're good here. We just, you 
know, alley oop him all the time, you know? If we're just constantly doing a loopy loop, we won't be able to get a good hit on this. Oh, trying to blindside us here. Am I even hitting this guy? I don't even think I'm hitting this guy. For real? For real? You know what, he looks pretty beat up. Maybe we should just try and... Yep, yeah, maybe we should just try and... Oh, jeez. Not now. Not now. Oh, my God. He got right at the last second. <sighs> it's not clear. It's not clear how to beat this guy. <laughs> but I think we were doing it there. That was like... He was stumbling and he was staggering and I don't think he could have survived if we'd have thrown those uh, crates at him. So I don't know, maybe we're good. I'm tempted to take these, to be honest, but... And then leave these behind. Grab the first aid spray. Just wail on him right at the beginning. Because, let's face it, this is clearly... A last boss of some description. Really glad I saved it. Can I just say that? Can I just say that real quick? <laughs> Ugh, I need another drink. And maybe that's what I'm missing. Maybe if I get a cup of tea, this will all go swimmingly. No, you can't rely on tea your whole life, Morris. Wow, these guns are really bad. <laughs> oh, that was not a great decision there. Oh, God. Right, so you can dodge that as long as you run out of the way. Yeah, because look, he's kind of like... Let's do the old alley-oop. Oh, you can't even do the old alley-oop. Oh my god, he's got me. What? For real? Ah, oh, that sucks. Okay, that was even worse than last time. Let's try again. You know what, let's just go straight for these, because these are blatantly the most powerful. Wow, how are you supposed to do this without first aid sprays? I'll never know. Alright, what else have we got? Is there anything else we can just take? Can I just throw the empty extinguisher at him? Is that not gonna work? Because this grenade launcher is so slow. Like, I can hit him twice, and then I gotta run away, and then I can't even dodge, I don't even know how you dodge. Can you dodge in the, can you do a little dodge mechanic, like in Resi 3? This is the only thing about these games that sort of gets to you after a little while. <laughs> is the lack of, I mean, the controls are fine for me, but... When you... Excuse me. When you're fighting enemies like this, it just doesn't work. Right, so I'm just doing that just to give me some space. Christ. See what I mean? You're like, you can't dodge that. You just gotta kind of deal with it. I'm like, look at that, he just threw me against the wall. Oh, that's killed me. Shit! Ugh. Just trash me. I mean, look at this. Look at the arena I'm fighting in. Why am I doing so much worse than before? Sure wish I had like those explosive rounds. Ugh. Alright, ink ribbons away. <laughs> away with you. Okay, I'm gonna use these three bogan rounds straight away. Then I'm gonna switch to acid, whale on him. Switch to BOW, whale on him. Switch to flame, whale on him. I mean, as long as I can hit him enough times before he can hit me, it's fine. It's a DPS race, as far as I can see. Okay, so what we'll do... We'll just swing this out straight away. And then we shall absolutely wail on him with this. And we'll switch to this. I just need to so I'm not against... Oh, that's the worst thing that could have happened. I need to so I'm not against the wall, that's all. Two... Three... Four... Alright, what else we got? 
Oh god. Oh jeez. No, not tonight. Okay, first aid spray. Then BW gas rounds. I assume I haven't missed. Oh my god. Oh, she didn't even auto aim that time. Great. Okay, let's not get trapped in here, shall we? Oh jeez. See, look, he's looking rough now. He's looking rough as hell. That didn't really work. <laughs> like, does he look wrecked? Yeah, he looks wrecked now. Let's do it. Let's go for it. Oh, yes, son. That worked. That worked. That was good, ladies and gents. That was good. Is that an item? That looks like one of those albinoid things. But, like, in the back of the plane? <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> but hey, we got a trophy. It's all good. Whew. What was wrong? Oh, nothing. Just a giant cockroach that had to be stepped on. Oh, I'm Claire, and I'm so cocky, even though you just saw me die, like, nine times. <laughs> What's happening? I don't know. The plane just changed direction on its own. Steve. Thought you knew how to fly this thing. It's flying in autopilot mode. Which reminds me, Steve, how do I you can't know switch how to fly this manual thing? control? My apologies, but I cannot let you escape now. <laughs> Alfred, cross-dressing freak. Is it Alfred or is it Alexia? Which way? What do you prefer? I mean, you're using the woman's voice, so. Well, this is all very romantic. Or it would be if I didn't have all this blood all over me. Don't try it, Steve. I know you think you should try it now, but I wouldn't. Ah, oh, he's going for it. I told you you shouldn't try it, Steve. Where the hell are we? Hey, where are we? Huh? Latitude, 82.17 degrees. That's the Antarctic. We're over the Antarctic! What? Great. <laughs> wow, this hey, rate we're gonna be under the those Antarctic. Those are the seaplanes right? that left the island right before us! Then that must mean... This place belongs to Umbrella! Seems to be a lot of downed aircraft around here as well. Save first half end data? Okay. <laughs> Intermission. Starting part two. What is this? Is this like disc two or something? I sure wish we had used those seatbelts. Oh. Hey, wake up, Steve. Oh. Damn it, Steve. Oh. Tired of your lollygagging. We're still alive. So it would seem. Yeah, 
Yeah, right. <laughs> Is this really the time of the place, Steve? My god. What are you, 16? Thanks. Oh, he just kind of looks 16. <laughs> Oh, uh, <coughs> plane's trashed. Well, let's wow, Steve, is that your expert opinion? This, 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 this plane won't fly. This plane will definitely not fly. Okay, let's do it. Doesn't have any wings. Oh, crap, wow, what am I doing? <laughs> the plane cannot be used anymore. There's no need to go back. Oh, right, yeah, because I was just about to fly away from this thing. Where the hell am I? I don't even know what this, th this place is. Jeez. Alrighty, well, I guess I better pause it for now, guys. But thank you very much for watching this episode of Code Veronica, and please do join me for the next one, guys, where you will see me completely fail even harder than I just did, because I don't even know where I am. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in a bit. See you later.